like I do a lot, I'm getting ready to cut this tree. This one's a little more dangerous than the ones I normally do. Obviously, I have cerebral palsy if you watch my videos, and my balance isn't that great, and I can't get away. So I'm trying to figure out the best way to cut this tree. I think because the tree is kind of leaning that way, it's but there's two uh, limbs up there. They're wedged in between this tree. And as you can see, it's splitting right here. So what I'm gonna do is like up cut about right here. So in case it does come this way, I can probably get out of the way. I'm, I would cut it back there, back there, but I'm not because the, uh, the tree is, uh, that that tree might follow me and I might not be able to get away if it falls if it falls that way so I'm just gonna cut it right here because if the worst case scenario does fall this way does fall that way I can probably get out of the way quick enough but once I start cutting I think I'll be able to now Well, I cut through the entire side of this log. I got down to there. I thought it'd probably break off by now, but it hasn't. So I'm probably gonna have to cut more up there. Fortunately, the, the, uh, this part of the tree fell kind of the way I wanted it to. Um, it uh, basically broke, which I didn't really know it would do, but I kind of expected, I guess. It broke down there where I cut it, and then it, it, this is where I was cutting it before. So this part didn't break at all, but I'm going to have to get this one off eventually which is probably going to be the scariest one of them all and the most difficult. But I'm glad I got these with not too much trouble. And the nice thing about this is, well, I guess there's nothing that's nice about that one. Be what I was going to say is it's leaning in those branches, but that's not going to really matter because I'm probably going to cut it about right there so but I'll, I'll have to cut this one up first and then basically what I'm going to do is later I'll, I'll drag them out and then I'll be able to actually get to them with my truck <laughs> Mm. 
that one was kind of difficult but fortunately it didn't spring back or nothing bad happened because that could have been bad with, with it being difficult for me to get away from the wood but it was it was actually easier than I thought and for that I'm happy here is it here it is right here now it's not dangerous because I can just drag it out so I'll be able to cut it up then easily thanks for watching